Hey guys, welcome back. This is my vlog for Star Wars Resistance, Episode 3, Fuel for the Fire. And my initial thoughts of this episode, it was alright. It kind of retreads territory that was already in the previous episode, and so it doesn't do much else than that. But overall, it's a fun episode that I found some enjoyment in. It has some good comedic moments, but overall it's nothing special. It's nothing like the first episode, which I thought was really good. So what is this about? Well, this time Kaz is, he's still dealing with having to work all these odd jobs for Yeager, and he just can't deal with it. He wants to, of course, work for the Resistance, and he doesn't want to be doing this, and eventually he meets this young man who's a racer named Jace, played by Elijah Wood, interestingly, and Jace gets him involved in stealing some fuel from Yeager, and he gets in this mess and what I liked about this episode, though, is something that I mentioned in my first video, is that I wanted to know a little bit more about Yeager. And we don't get much, but we get hints of it. There's a scene where Kaz goes into Yeager's room or house or whatever you want to call it, and he sees, like, a picture of him that he was once part of the rebellion and he had a family. It's just a little small thing that gives us a little taste of maybe what's to come. It seems that this season or maybe later on in the show we'll be learning a little bit more about Yeager and this episode really does deal a little bit more with him and Kaz's relationship which I do like. They have a respect for each other. Of course, Kaz is an idiot at times and doesn't want to listen, but I think he does learn some valuable lessons here about doing the right thing, and Yeager ultimately says that Kaz has a good heart. And it's clear that he does because he ends up trying to do the right thing in the end. He just ends up doing the wrong thing in the beginning. But yeah, overall, I thought this was a alright episode. Not as good as the first, and not as good as the second, but it does have some good heart to it. It's got some good comedic bits. A uh, little near the end, um, there's one joke that just doesn't work, but overall, I thought this was a fun episode, and of course, I can't wait to see more. I'm really interested in this show to see what it'll do and what comes next. So, yeah, that's really all I got to say for this episode. Um, as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog.